My name is Gracie Rawlings and I'm the OU Daily Assistant Sports Editor. The Sooners are coming off of an 82 to 66 win over number 21 BYU. My top takeaway was OU's ability to defend on the perimeter. This was a huge point of emphasis for head coach Porter Moser coming into the game. BYU is the best three-point shooting team in the nation. They make 12.1 a game. And so seeing OU stay in that drop coverage, allowing them to stay tight on their man, forcing BYU to either drive or shoot a quick shot, um, I thought was really effective. My second takeaway is how effective OU's bench was tonight. The trio composed of Latre Darthard, Rivaldo Soares, and John Hughley were a huge part of OU's non-conference success. Latre Darthard was coming off of a big game at UCF where he dropped 14 points. And even though he only scored a three tonight, it was really early in the game and it helped OU get on the board. Rivaldo Soares played the same role he always does. He was active with his hands. He got steals, he got blocks, he got rebounds. And he also was able to put the ball on the floor and score and also score from the three-point line. And then Don Hughley provided a big presence inside, which was needed because senior Sam Godwin was really struggling tonight uh, to get going, especially in the first half, and BYU had, had a big team. My final takeaway is how JVL McCollum and Milo Suzan both bounced back tonight. They both kind of struggled in the first half and didn't really produce, but they kept on shooting and Milo ended up with 16 points and he uh, grabbed five boards and tossed out four assists and he helped OU go into halftime kind of in the position to build a lead in the second half. And McCollum really stepped it up in the second. Um, kind of picking up where Yuzan left off. He had a 20-point game. Um, he went, He earned a lot of points at the free throw line. So it was just nice to see how they responded. 